Hey guys, how's it going? BCHD here to welcome back to another video on the channel. This time it is going to be a Bayern Super League career mode episode. I know I haven't posted for a while now. We've finally reached January. We're on top of the table by seven points and I've reached a bit of a sticky situation. I didn't post an episode last week. We reached a January transfer window, of course, but five million pounds. We can't really spend anything on a player unless we do a swap deal uh, but yeah we are really restricted right now financially especially in the transfer window we've got a few games in January we've got a match against Sevilla uh, in the Super League of course but yeah if you guys are keen for this episode and for the series to continue make sure to slap a like on the video Sevilla get the opening goal subscribe down below for some more FIFA 19 career mode content uh, of course we got the second half of the season to get underway but I'm looking to wrap this career mode up quickly before FIFA 20 and Lewandowski with the goal there to make it 2-1 we end up getting the three points away at Sevilla to continue our hot streak turn on post notifications so you never miss out on a video follow me on Twitter the link is in the description down below comment down below of course on what you want to see on the channel we've got another simmable game up against Doncaster Rovers but yeah guys we are back with the Bayern Super League career mode uh, we're probably going to use the same squad in there against Doncaster surely three points out of this one if if not the three points surely we can progress through the next round in this game because if we don't that's going to be a bit worrying but we're going to skip it one nil oh my gosh Gareth Bale getting a goal against English opposition like he has done in the Super League but we continue on uh, to our next big game and it is going to be against Napoli AC Milan Simmable games, you know what? We're just gonna play this one against Man United at Old Trafford. And would you look at that? We won both games against Italian opposition there in Napoli and Milan. Of course, we won the cup game against Doncaster and then we drew against Inter. So I'm not sure what's gonna happen there if we're gonna play a replay of that game, but we're gonna go into our first game of the episode against Manchester United. We're gonna have a replay against Inter Milan, who we did draw with in the Super League. So it'll be interesting. I uh, guess we have a game against the Manchester United. All right, Manchester United away, Old Trafford. We come here again on a rainy night in the Super League. We're coming up against Muller, our former player. He has moved to Manchester United in this career mode save. Hopefully we can get this episode off to a first win here at the end of January. Let's see what we can do against the Red Devils. No, Jimenez lost the ball. Jesse Lingard swings that one in. Neuer punches it. What is he doing? He's in on goal. We can't clear the ball. We can't clear the ball. We can't clear the ball. What just happened there? Muller gets a goal against his former employers in Bayern Munich. Muller comes back to haunt us. And United have gotten the lead here in the opening 15 minutes. What has transpired in that passage of play? We couldn't clear the ball with Goretzo. We couldn't clear the ball with Jimenez. We, we got deflected off Pogba. And then it landed straight to the path of Muller. It was written in the stars. You can't write scripts like this. Muller at Old Trafford comes back to haunt us here. Rise up. Have it straight away. Straight away. It's Lewandowski straight away. He's not messing any. He's not messing about. Robert Lewandowski. Look at his new face. It is looking absolutely sublime in the new game. Looking very lifelike. The Polish man, Robert Lewandowski. Our main man in this Super League career mode. He has been on fire and we hit back straight away. No time for United to celebrate. It's a beautiful shot to the top right hand corner from the Polish marksman. And we're back in the game, baby. Lewandowski again, oh, sends whoever the United defender was to the shops, and it's going to be Alfonso Davies. That could have been so good. Pogba with the shot. Are you kidding me? Yet another deflection goal. Deflected straight to the path of Lukaku. Come on, man. This is just, you just know FIFA's not on your side this game. Lukaku smashes that one in, and look here, we're going to have a look at the replay. Pogba smashes it, deflected, and it's off Jimenez again. No, it's off Sewell. Ah, oh, that is terrible, boys. Come on, United have had, literally had two shots and they've both gone in. 2-1 to the Red Devils. This is terrible play. Pogba, Jimenez again. Oh, Neuer with the save. Alfonso Davies. The Canadian down this left-hand side. He can swing a ball in. He can swing a ball in. It's going to be Lewandowski straight to the path of De Gea. Need an equaliser before halftime. Goretzka can see Davies in the box. Davies still has it. Gives it off to Goretzka. And that is the equaliser. It is 2-2 in stoppage time. Leon Goretzka with an absolute banger. And we've equalised things at Old Trafford here. It's four goals in the opening half. What a game we have on our hands here. 
and we aren't even halfway through the Bayern Munich fans absolutely loving that goal Alfonso Davies did well to keep it gave it off to the man Goretzka and first time finish into the top left hand corner the German midfielder that is going to be half time 2-2 at Old Trafford it's it back to Leon Goretzka he fancies one Goretzka fancies another and it's over the bar Lewandowski Nabry off to Havertz. What can he do here? The German! Oh, it's just gone wide. Goretzka. Oh, that's a beautiful ball into Kai Havertz. Finish that, son. It's scrappy. It was a bit scrappy from Kai Havertz, but a goal's a goal. It gets over the line, and we get the goal to put us in the lead for the first time in this match. 3-2 to the Bayern boys in the Super League, and what a passage of play. Beautiful threaded ball. Kai Havertz. De Gea replicating his form in real life and letting that one slip through the cracks. Pushed away by Neuer. Oh, Pogba's made a strike. And that could have been a massive goal for United. Texas Nabry getting back well to defend, but he loses it again to the Chilean. Oh, no way. No way! Another goal where... Are you... Am I the only one seeing this? Muller comes back to haunt us, not once, but twice. Thomas Muller... How has that even happened? Navri had the ball. He took it off him. It goes straight across goal. Hits the post. Could have gone anywhere, but it falls straight to the feet of Thomas Muller. And look at that. Really creeped it into the top right. It's a six-goal thriller in Manchester. United get the 3-3 equaliser. And that is going to be full-time. 3-3, it ends at Old Trafford. Muller comes back to haunt us with a brace. All right, boys, you won't believe it. We've done a bit of wheeling and dealing before the transfer window shuts and we brought in the Jamaican winger in Leon Bailey, the man from Bayer Leverkusen, has joined us here at Bayern Munich in the Super League, a new player in the Super League. He's going to be replacing Kingsley Coman. We picked him up for 6.5 million plus Kingsley Coman, so Kingsley Coman heads the other way to Bayer Leverkusen. He is, uh, yeah, like you saw last episode, he's out for seven months, so he's pretty much useless for the rest of this career mode. So we brought in the young 21-year-old Leon Bailey. I haven't used him yet in fact. FIFA 19 career mode, so hopefully you'll be a good pickup and a good addition to this Bayern Munich squad. But we're going to head into deadline day. Don't think uh, any deals are going to be done. Managed with £5 million. Pick up a player in Leon Bailey, which is an absolute beast of a signing. And that is going to end deadline day. We are done at the transfer business. We're going to have a look and see what some other Super League clubs have done in the transfer window. I don't think uh, too many big transfers have happened. Milinkovic Savic went to Barcelona. Ziek went to Manchester United. Of course, we picked up Bailey. Belotti went to Arsenal. Kimbembe went to Borussia Dortmund. Kramaric went to AC Milan. Of course, we picked up Werner and Havertz. Brahimi went to Juve. Bergwijn went to Real Madrid. Marcelo went to Man City. Ika Muniain went to Inter Milan. This is what we're going to get into the second half of the season. All right, game against Roma to uh, put Bailey in there. Number seven, he is going to start off his debut game up against Roma. And we lose that one. Unda with the goal. Lewandowski misses the penalty. That's a shock loss. Not a good way for Bailey to get his debut either. All right, this is a side going into the game against Inter Milan away from home. It's a round four FA Cup replay. Let's go and get the dub at San Siro. All right, FA Cup time at the San Siro. It's still weird to look at that. But yeah, Bayern Munich up against Inter. We drew against them in the Super League, so hopefully we can get some revenge. FA Cup around for replay. Of course, Inter Milan very strong at home, but we're going to get underway. So Taliso finds Timo Werner, and what a save from Handanovic. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh Alaba. Oh no, Sanchez loses it. Nine Golan misses. Sanchez can find the run. Timo Werner, go on, son. He's on a yellow card, but he's going to finesse it into the bottom left-hand corner, and it just goes wide. Finds James Rodriguez. Werner gets to it. Werner, he's through on goal, and that is finally a goal. He's rewarded for all his shots on goal, and we get underway here at the San Siro. Timo Werner, and we go 1-0 up. The travelling Bayern Munich fans are loving that. We've been dominating the first opening minutes. It was a challenge from Gagliardini, I think. But uh, Werner did well there. Thrashed that one outside of the boot. And a goal gives it off to James Rodriguez. Sees the run of Gareth Bale. What can the Welshman do here? On his favourite left foot, he's going to cut back inside. Hummels misses out on the challenge there. Nine Golan in on goal. We all know how dangerous the Belgian is. And he's given it off. Oh, Talisa's won it back. It was a poor touch from Asamoah Jean. We've put it through to Leroy Sane. What can the German do? He's been quiet over the past few games. And what a goal from Leroy Sane. He gets his goal-scoring form back. 
And the German winger is back on form here at the San Siro. He's gotten the double for us here. We've gone 2-0 up right after the first half. And we might be through to the FA Cup round five thanks to that beautiful strike. What a goal. To Keita Balde. Oh, Hernandez completely missed him. Keita Balde gives it off to Ivan Perisic. And what a save from Manuel Neuer yet again. Oh, no. Lautaro. Oh, it's going to be a consolation goal. They've half the deficit here with Lautaro Martinez. Don't think it's going to matter. But we're going to go ahead and skip it. Surely we can just waste a bit of time here for extra time. The ref can blow the full time whistle. And there it is. We're through to the next round of the FA Cup. Right, a game against Inter again in the Super League away from home at the San Siro. We got the job done in the FA Cup. Can we do it in the Super League? That is a, the important question here. Lewandowski there with a goal, continuing his goal scoring form. Vecino gets off injured. We get the 2 0 win. It's Lewandowski with the brace. All right, boys, we're away at Chelsea for the round of 16 in the FA Cup. It's going to be another big one at Stamford Bridge. Let's get into it. Another chance to go further in the FA Cup. Another chance to extend our cup run. Comes up against English opposition in Chelsea. We're at Stamford Bridge, a place we've been to a lot in the Chelsea career mode. But we're in the Bayern career mode now. See what goes down. Sane down this left-hand side. Another buccaneering run from the German winger. Oh, he's going to hit it again. And it's gone through. Kepa makes a howler of it. And Leroy Sane continues his scoring form. Getting us the opener here. In the FA Cup se oh, no, semi-final round of 16 against Chelsea. What a run from him. What an assist from Lewandowski. And he gets the ball back from Rudiger. Kepa, what a howler. Oh, it's going to be a goal from Leon. Gar no, it is Lewandowski. I keep getting him confused. And we get the second here at Stamford Bridge. We're steamrolling through Chelsea at the moment. And it's the cross in. This time, the return from Leroy Sane. He returns the favor to Lewandowski. He gets his goal to get us two goals to the good. Sane. Oh, beautiful feet there from the German. That, oh, beautiful play from Lewandowski. Oh, Bale. That is the third. The Welshman gets us the third. Surely that is game over. Gareth Bale yet again with a beaut. And it's halftime. 3-0. Did Chelsea even turn up for the second half at this point? We're going to carry it out, but surely we're into the next round. It's going to be James Rodriguez. That was nearly the fourth, but Sane's won it back here. It's going to fool the entire defense, and we're going to hit it, and that was terrible. All right, put Chelsea out of their misery. It ends up being 3-0. All right, Tottenham Hotspur at home. Surely we can slap them up. Tottenham Hotspurs, we beat them at their new stadium. Surely at the Allianz Arena, they can't cope. And we win 1-0. Timo Werner with an 84th minute winner. Another three points in the Super League. Okay, Monaco at home. Same starting 11. We're not uh, changing things up here. They're not doing well in the Super League, but we're going to simulate it. And it's another 1-0 win. We're grinding out these three points. Lewandowski with a 30th minute winner. Liverpool away from home. A Super League game. With uh, not much importance, but yet again, uh, Liverpool did knock Bayern Munich out of the Champions League. And there we go. Easy does it. Lewandowski and Rodriguez with the two. That gets us the three points. Look what we have here. This could be time for revenge. We all know what they did to us. The Super League beat us 4-0 at home on our own patch. Now we have the chance to go to them and defeat them in the FA Cup around six to book our place in the semi-finals. Barcelona taking on Stoke City, Dortmund vs United, and PSG vs AC Milan. Interesting FA Cup quarterfinals there. Santiago Bernabeu. Dreams are made and hearts are broken here in Madrid. We've seen Bayern Munich get robbed here in the Champions League in real life. Can we redeem it? Happened a few seasons ago, but it's still fresh in the minds of the Bayern fans. What can we do here in a huge FA Cup deciding game? We need to redeem ourselves after that Super League result. And the boys are out to get revenge. Oh no, Modric. What can the Croatian do? It's to Hunter. James Rodriguez, former player for Real. And Courtois gets down. Wondowski. The former player in Gareth Bale. What can he do here against his former employers? Gareth Bale. Giving off to Hernandez. Hernandez finds his way through. He's going to sweat it to Sane. And that's the opener. Leroy Sane, the man of the episode so far, has been absolutely crucial in this video. Scoring some mad FA Cup goals. And he's done so again here at the Santiago Bernabeu. Most important game yet of the episode. Leroy Sane, a beautiful assist. A beautiful vision from Lucas Hernandez. 
And it was a top draw finish from the German winger. Been on fire. And find another former player in James Rodriguez. He can escape the defense. He does. The Colombian threw on goal here. What can he do with his left boot? It's going to be the second. James Rodriguez, formerly of Real Madrid, gets a goal at the Bernabeu against his former club. What a story. And he celebrates right in front of the home fans. He knows what it means for Bayern Munich. The away fans absolutely loving it. 2 0. What a run from James Rodriguez. A bit of individual brilliance from the Colombian. Takes us two goals to the good. It's half time. We're two goals up at the Bernabeu. Still a job to be done in the second 45. Oh, Bale. The wrong goal. Can he get the third? Of course he does. Gareth Bale with a goal against his former club. He gets the third for Bayern Munich in the 55th minute. Hammers. it was. And the two extra Madrid boys celebrate. It was Hammers the first goal. And then now Bale after some... Questionable defending from Sergio Ramos. We slot it into the bottom right-hand corner. Courtois left dumbfounded. That's a penalty. We have the chance to get four. Exactly what Real Madrid did to us at the Allianz Arena. It's going to be Nacho Fernandez conceding that one on the already injured Sane in the penalty box. So I get Lewandowski. He is our top goal scorer. So we just go straight down the middle. See what happens here. Oh, wow. Great. <laughs> Great. Lewandowski can put through Gareth Bale. What can come of this? The Welshman sees Lewandowski. Surely that's the fourth. Oh, nearly. And that's the fourth. Oh, that is the fourth. Hammers gets a double against his former employers. And we've gone 4-0 up. Surely that's us into the next round. And what we... And what Real did to us at our home, we did exactly to them at theirs. But this time it's in the FA Cup. We're now through to the semi-finals of the famous old competition. Well, bad news looks like Taliso is out for two months with a torn quadricep muscle. Sounds painful, hopefully he gets better. We seem the rest of March after that Real Madrid game, we end up getting a win against a PSG. We drew against Barca and we won against Atletico. So that is seven points in three games. Now we've got this game away against Leon, which we're just gonna simulate to end off the episode and hopefully get a decent result. Doesn't really matter considering we're dominating the league so much, but we're going to simulate it anyway. And Leon got the win there, so okay, we cop another loss. Shouldn't matter, as uh, we are clearly top of the Super League here. These are the standing after this episode, and we're on top by 12 points, ending up with 76 points. Real Madrid right behind us with 64, Spurs with 61, and PSG far, far away, 26 points behind us in fourth with 50 Barca, Man United in mid-table. Got Dortmund, Napoli, Arsenal down in 13th. Sevilla, Roma, and now AC Milan have entered the relegation zone. Liverpool, Chelsea just surviving. AS Monaco right outside the relegation zone. Atletico Madrid and Man City tied in 5th. But that is an interesting looking Super League table. Be at the end of the video, guys. If you did enjoy it, make sure to smack a like on it. Probably going to have the season finale up next. And then the last month of the Super League, which looks absolutely insane. Man City, Real Madrid, Chelsea and Arsenal to round off the Super League. Plus some FA Cup drama at Wembley. Uh, hopefully it goes down well. Hopefully it'll be an amazing season finale. But for now, I hope you did enjoy the video. Make sure to subscribe down below so you never miss a video. Hit the notification bell so you never miss out on an upload. Comment down below. Comment down below or your feedback. Follow me on Twitter. The link is in the description. I've been BCHD. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the season finale.